everybody, and welcome to this week's episode of Parker's Tutorials. And this week, I'm showing you how to make a fake cinder block that you can karate chop. Let's get started. A big sheet of styrofoam and not foam core poster board. Plaster of Paris, white and black paint, a hot glue gun, and cock. Yo, diggity dog, let's get building, yo. The first step in this project is to take a semi-thick board of styrofoam and make the form of a cinder block. I found out that just one piece of styrofoam was too thin, so I hot glued a thinner strip to the semi-thick strips. Parker's Tutorials will be right back. And we're back. After that, I started to assemble the cinder block. I made two horizontal styrofoam planks, and then I glued three square styrofoam planks on the, in the right, left, and middle. After that, I applied some caulk to the corners to make the corners rounded. After that, it's time to apply plaster of Paris. Mix up a batch of plaster and use a thick paintbrush and paint the plaster on the styrofoam. When the plaster dries, give it a coat of gray paint and you're done. Now it's time for the test film. Oh, I didn't see you there. Hi, I'm a real life ninja. And today I'm going to show you how to be a real life ninja. The first thing of being a ninja is to break a cinder block. The technique is very simple. Be sure to keep your arms straight and your hand perpendicular to the ground. What the? <laughs> Observe. <laughs> ah! We're good. Hungry hippos using loud and unnecessary sound effects. What the? What the? What the? What the? The fourth step is to balance a laser cannon arm on your chin. Look at that schizo. Now you too know how to be a ninja. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Parker's Tutorial. Bye everybody!